All right, well, we dealt with some rain, but we didn't see the heavy rain like they saw farther to the south into lower Michigan. But for us throughout the evening, noticing more of the clearing sky, we are already beginning to see some of that sun and things starting to look a little more like summer, or at least they will tomorrow for sure for us. But let's take a look at our summer countdown eight days away. That will be next Sunday, not this coming Sunday, but next Sunday, June the 21st at 1238 p.m. So only about another week or so of spring, but let's take a look at the satellite and radar composite. There goes all the rainfall now making his way into southern Ontario, actually seeing some severe weather as you go into Ohio. But for us, things will quiet down as we head into the evening. Clear skies will allow temperatures to drop off into the mid to upper 40s for overnight lows remaining quiet. And then even as we head into Saturday, we'll be pretty much quiet as well before tomorrow evening. A few more of those clouds roll in and we'll be looking out for another chance of rain getting into late Saturday night. Right now we are at 66 degrees, but look at all the sun that is currently out there for us. Winds out of the north northeast at 12 miles per hour and temperatures. Uh, they're going to be a little back and forth. I'm seeing more of the 60s here across central UP, western UP. Things are warming up even more. 73 in Ironwood at 72 in Ontonagon. A little cool in Tohoton at 52 degrees, 74 down in Menominee and eastward. Seeing lower 60s in Munising and in Manistique, 68 in Sault Ste. Marie, St. Ignace right now at 64 degrees, Iron Mountain at 74, and Ishpeming right now at 66. Your winds coming in from that northerly direction behind the cold front, so not really seeing that much of the cooler air mass, but things are going to cool off a little more for us as we head into the evening, just not so much and nothing like what we saw a couple of weekends, weekends ago. Nine miles per hour in Houghton, three in Iron Mountain, while at 13 coming in from the southeast in Escanaba, and nine out of the southeast in Munising and temperatures across the state. Well, farther to the south, still seeing more of those warm conditions in Detroit at 80 degrees. A little farther to the north, that's where the cold front is right there. You can see where you'll drop off into uh, the 60s as opposed to the 70s that they're seeing down in Flint. And for us, well, we got that cool air mass out of here, but the sun is really helping out to warm things up for us across western UP. So uh, we'll see more of that as we head into the afternoon tomorrow. But tonight it will be a tad cool for us with clear skies and that's very, very slightly cooler air mass in place. And that is only going to keep or drop us back down into the mid and upper 40s which is not too bad for us right around where we should be during this time of the year. Sunny early as we go into Saturday, but clouds will arrive late and then we'll be looking out for more of those showers and storms as we go into late Saturday night and Sunday. Now, once again, it looks like our storm activity or at least the thunderstorm activity will be on the low end. Maybe a few rumbles of thunder, but we're going to see that most of the energy will be farther off to the south with this system mostly coming in tomorrow night. So that'll keep down on the instability for us as we head into Sunday. But here's a look at our setup area of high pressure moving its way off to the east it has that cool air in place right now, but that will give way to warmer air as we get into our tomorrow and by tomorrow, expecting that the front continues to work its way off to the east. Uh, but for us, it will be a quiet afternoon before the next chance of rain comes in by tomorrow night. Your future cast model mostly clear throughout the evening for us. Clouds uh, in and out, but then as we head into Saturday evening, here's our next chance of rain starting to make its way northward. Chances will uh, be in and out as we get into Saturday night and then another one as we go into Sunday and you can see right there just skirting the region once again. So it looks like this one is going to even take more of a southern track than uh, what we previously previously expected. So I'm uh, probably not going to see a lot of heavy rain, but it will be spots of rain from here to there. So almost a repeat, just not as much of the heavy rain as what we saw in southern uh, UP right now or tonight. We're expecting temperatures to drop off into the 40s at 46 degrees quiet and cool winds very calm and for us on Saturday warm and pleasant winds out of the southeast at 5 to 15 miles per hour 71 in Lons at 74 in Ontonagon calling for the lower 70s also in Crystal Falls at 73 degrees 67 in Munising 69 in Manistique and at 69 in Marquette. Your seven day forecast for us on Saturday, mostly sunny. Seeing more clouds as we head into the evening. Showers for us on Sunday. Also seeing more of the showers, slighter chance, and a very small chance at 30%, and with highs in the upper 60s. Behind that, uh, noticing highs mostly in the lower 60s as we go into next Tuesday and Thursday, and lows will be in the middle 40s, so a little below average, but still expecting more of that sunshine Tuesday and Wednesday.